This maxillary molar presents with no findings clinically or radiographically. Three separate x-rays taken at three differing angles collectively still didn't yield enough information to obtain a definitive diagnosis. On the axial plane of the comb beam scan, the outline of the palatal root can be seen in blue, and the white arrow indicates the point of the perforation. In the coronal plane, again, the palatal root is outlined in blue, and the extruded gutta percha can be seen, indicated by the white arrows. And the bottom of the sinus cavity is indicated in orange. Dr. Cantor's palatal approach involved a sulcular and one vertical releasing incision. The root was sectioned at the point of the perforation and the apical segment was removed. The x-ray gives us a good two-dimensional representation of a three-dimensional spatial relationship and the comb beam scan gives us that three-dimensional spatial relationship.